Um, NexusS is a great device for using it around town. It's light, fits in my pocket. But when I get home or to my hotel room, I would love to use a different form factor. For me, the new Motorola Zoom tablet is a great delivery device for media. Now, these new devices are great not only for consuming media, but also creating it. With the advent of 4G networks, users will be enabled to use high quality video over wireless networks like never before. Today, I'm going to demonstrate for you uh, Movie Studio, a new Android application which allow users to edit videos. It's an application built from the ground up for the tablet form factor. So let me show you what I mean. So I'm going to open uh, Movie Studio. You're going to see that I have here a few projects that I've been working on. And I prepared a project for the purpose of this demo. Now, in this project, I already imported three images and one video clip. As you can probably tell, on the first image, I already added a title that says that I pretty much enjoyed my trip back in time in Barcelona. What I would like to show you is some of the customizations you can bring to Movie Studio to fit your artistic ability. So, one of the things we can do is we can reorder these media items in the movie timeline. How about I grab this nice picture of the National Palace and move it right after the first picture. I really like this one, so let's take a quick look at it and add a special effect to it. How about a pan and zoom effect? So I'll select pan and zoom. Now I have the ability to change independently the start and the end uh, rectangle. So let's leave the start where it is. And for end, maybe I'll just do a little bit of zoom, just for the effect. There we go. I could customize this project in, in many other ways. I can change the duration of images in the timeline. I could trim the beginning or end of video clips. I can add color effects to my photos and to my video clips. Now let's look towards the end of the movie. This is a video clip I took. Um, I don't want my movie to end this abruptly, and therefore I was thinking a nice fade to black transition will look good at the end. So let's look at that. And my movie is almost done, but I think something is missing. I know. I think a nice background audio track would make this movie interesting, so I believe that it would be appropriate. So it's a Spanish guitar too. So I'll import that into my movie. And um, we are ready to preview this movie now. Okay. That will give you an idea of how the movie would look like. About, let's watch that trend. Good. I'm happy with that. Now, once you have the movie set up the way you want it, how about we export this movie, make it a real movie, and we'll select the movie size, so we'll make it 720p, and the quality, let's say, high, and export it. Now, I'm not going to export this now, it would take a little bit of time, and we don't have that now, so I already did that before this demo. And I'm ready now to share this movie with my friends on YouTube. I'm going to select that I want to share it on YouTube. Let's just call it Barcelona 2011. How appropriate. And there you go. The upload has started. Now, I hope I get net happy here with my network connection in a second. So what we're going to do is we're going to switch to YouTube and we're going to look in my channel where I usually see my downloads. Let's just wait a little bit. 
And uh, we should mention, by the way, that this is the new Honeycomb operating system. It sure is, and I hope everyone will enjoy the new Honeycomb release on the Zoom tablet. This is the part where we have to... Yes, this is the problem of having a networking convention. Everyone is on the network, including the special networks. That's right. I think we'll just, they, they will just have to trust me that the movie is there. <laughs> this is a Google I, engineer saying, trust me. <laughs> Either way, the movie is public, so they can enjoy it on they YouTube. Can, you, can see it on, you can see it on YouTube. <laughs> That's right. Um, I hope you enjoy this uh, short run-through to the features of Movie Studio. Thank you. Thank you very much, Joe. Uh, Thank you very much, yes. So, so, I wanted to show you that because I wanted to give you a sense of the power of the world that we're seeing, again, all in this particular case on a new and upcoming tablet on top of, of the Android platform. And when you play with, hand, with Honeycomb, you'll see the sense of, of, of beauty and 